G'day, how's it hanging? This is my uh, Farmer Dimitri look. Picked this hat up yesterday. Summertime's coming up here in Australia and it's, uh, it's pretty damn hot outside. And uh, in the middle of the day, you could fry an egg on a rock out there. So I thought I'd get a bit of sun protection. Um, the old school Aussies would uh, string um, wine, top corks corks down from the hats and so when you moved around the corks would sort of swing around the place to uh stop the flies from sitting on your face yeah that's what it's like out in the outback uh, australia anyway um i just want to say uh g'day to everyone and uh i'm still here um uh, please forgive me i've just been taking a bit of a break for a while and uh you know spending time with family going on a bit of a holiday, and uh, just a few other bits and pieces. But now I am going to get back into recording videos, and um, <laughs> I haven't checked many of the messages lately, but I noticed that was, um, people were saying that I've been dead. Uh, no. So basically, you should never ever listen to any reports of any bullshit like that, um, unless it come from someone... I guess Scarlett would be one person because she knows me personally. And, uh, you know, she's probably about one of the only people that you could trust that would put out a video with any significant information. But I'm still here and uh, I'm going to make some more videos for you. So I guess now's the time to, uh, I guess, make a few requests. Uh, just keep them simple. I'm going to try and put together a few short videos just to start with and uh, see how I go from there. So I've just been out in the garden, watering, fertilizing, trimming, raking, you know, just the normal stuff, the average Joe Dimitri farmer does here at home. Um, yeah, nothing special really has been going on, um, but I just want to put a little heads out. Um, Lauren Ostrowski Fenton, um, she's a lady that does uh, some ASMR videos in Australia. You can look below for a link to her YouTube channel. Um, I'm going to go on her podcast and um, it's going to be about the meaning of life. And uh, this is a subject that I'm interested in. Everyone really should be interested in a subject like this. Anyway, um, so I think that's going to get recorded next week and uh, I believe she puts them out pretty regularly so it should go live pretty quickly. So I'll let you know when it is. And you'll probably find a little bit more information in there on uh, stuff. Um, I guess that's about it. Oh, um, Triple J here in Australia is a local um, government-funded radio station. And uh, I did a bit of an interview with them. So they're putting uh, a bit of a story together um, about ASMR for... Uh, it's focused towards their age range of viewers, which is 18 to 24. So um, yeah, hopefully I'll get like maybe a 10 seconds, 20 seconds, or maybe a little bit more of air time on there. Um, and they're going to go through a, a broad range of um, information about ASMR on what they think it is, um, how it might relate to their the viewer audience. So I'll let you know when that comes live. Um, other than that, you know, life's just, pretty normal around here um uh so i'll see you soon and i'll record some more videos for you soon so hope you like my uh farmer joe look um it's a nice hat i actually picked this one up yesterday um we got like little vents in here let the air flow uh, i'm a little bit sweaty right now so please forgive me lots of air vents little things in here looks like a little bad um, it's got a thing on here to make it sorry about the word I focus it's pretty crap on this camera stop looking at my face a um, little thing to drawstring that's the brand of the product um, got this thing this is the old school style 
Um, I oh mean, this cat doesn't do it very well. Um, the um, old school vets, or World War One, World War Two, they'd wear their military hats, kind of one-sided. Um, you know, that's just like um, tradition here in Australia for uh, that type of style. But this is like just a classic hat. You know, it gives nice protection. Um, you can get it wet, doesn't matter, you can crunch it up into something small so I can fit it into my pocket. So there's a place here on the Gold Coast called Wet and Wild and um, I got some season tickets for there and uh, it's got lots and lots of water slides. It's actually a really nice place, I love going there. And, but man, it gets hot and uh, you roast out there in the summertime. Um, and so, you know, if you've got a hat like this, you can just basically, if you've got the right type of pants, you stick it in your pocket and um, go down the water slide. And once you finish, you just take it out all nice and wet and stick it on. So that's the plan. Um, I'm enjoying summer. Uh, been down to the beach, I've uh, been to Wet n Wild, been to Sea World, Dream World. Here on the Gold Coast, we're pretty lucky. We've got um, quite a few theme parks and I've uh, got a few season tickets. And uh, so we just go anytime that I want. Anyway, sorry about me rambling on. Um, I will get back to my housework. Really exciting stuff. And um, speak to you again very, very soon. Thanks.